Hey, Mark Oldman coming at you from my beloved New Jersey. Jersey has taken a lot of lumps in the media. You know, you've got the, the sensation of the Jersey Shore with their GTL, normally gym tanning laundry. But you know what? We're going to take back the tea. Jersey deserves a better tea, and it's going to be tea for tomato. Yeah, this is a real Jersey tomato, mid-August, fine, ripe, bloody beefsteak tomato. I came here to be country gentlemen. This is the real deal fruit stand in Martinsville, New Jersey, and we're going to have this luscious tomato. So luscious, if Jersey had a state flag that it was willing to change, I'd put this smack dab in the center of the state flag. So watch ahead. As with wine, you'll see what wine I pair with a Jersey beefsteak tomato. We're going to take back the tea. Okay, we are here in the tomato eating sanctum in New Jersey. And look, I've got all the accessories. I've got this bread that I bought earlier today at Italy in New York City, which is the Italian mega store, the gourmet store. Look at that bread. Oh my God. If you're a bread lover, this is the height. Then we've got, and I'm a little embarrassed I spent so much. Italy, you're a little bit expensive here. This is $18 butter imported from Italy. You gotta keep it great. I mean, sometimes you gotta push it to 11 a little bit, you call it 10 to 11. And then salt. Look at this salt. Real Italian. Let me show you what these granules of salt look like. Wow. When have you seen salt like that? Mm. So, what we're going to do, take the bread, okay, now we're going to cut a nice slice. This is real rustic bread. This is the real deal here, okay? Then, let's take some butter. I hear you out there. Mark, do you really want to use butter? Yeah, not olive oil, butter, real creamery butter. Look at the, that globule there. We're going to spread the butter. Still a little bit cold. Delicious. Now, this is where the food porn really kicks in. Look at this tomato. Look at just the color. It's almost an angry red there. Now we're going to take this tomato. Look at this great knife. I'm just going to cut that like this. My God. That is, uh, that's John Holmes' character. That is, that is Amber Lynn caliber food right there. And then, we cut that. Look at that, it's even heart-shaped. Why? Because it's all about Jersey love. We take our heart-shaped tomato, accidentally heart-shaped. We put it here. I'm going to take some rock salt. It's not really rock salt, but it's so, so big that I kind of call it that. Very fancy Italy salt. Butter, bread, tomato, and salt. Now, what wine do we have with our vine ripe and Jersey tomato? I like a wine with a lot of acidity because with wine and food pairing, acidity subdues acidity. So I like to choose a Chianti Classico. Keep, it, keep the Italian theme going, the Jersey theme here, and we're going to have a little Chianti. And, you know, you might be thinking, well, Chianti isn't that the thing in the straw flasks. Those are called fiascos, believe it or not. Uh, but no, no, no. This is not a Billy Joel state of mind kind of wine. This is modern Chianti, which tends to be kind of only medium bodied, not too tannic and kind of a sour cherry mm, with some kind of violet smell to it, like the flower. And you try it. I even chilled it up a little bit. And it's got great acidity, which is going to match so well with the acidity from our tomatoes. In fact, look at this Jersey tomato. It is so luscious that you can smell a Jersey tomato. It almost has its own wine-like aroma wafting off of it. It's really seductive. So, Chianti Classico, modern style, delicious, only medium body. Tomato on bread, the ultimate sandwich. Look at that. 
and let's match it up. Mm. Blissful. The salt and the acidity in the tomato work so well with this Chianti Classico. I'm going to say we have accomplished our goal and that is we have taken the tea back. The GTL Jim Tanning Laundry from Jersey Shore, we have reclaimed it for the forces of good. The tea is now tomato for Jersey tomato. Mark Oldman coming at you from the tomato room in New Jersey. Push it.